What's going on, gangsters? Movie John here. No, it's the horror man, but I got a box for Movie John. This package arrived today from my good buddy, Movie John. If for some reason you are not yet subscribed, I'm going to leave his channel link in the description box below as well as on the end screen of this video. Please be sure to subscribe, like his videos, show him some support. John is a great guy with an awesome channel, and you may actually remember him as one of our very first guests on the Super Slash Brothers show a while back. And after all this time, it's probably still one of my favorite streams we've had. It was so much fun. John started a brand new job this week, and he decided to sell some of his VHS tapes to make some money while he waits for his first paycheck. So being the awesome dude that he is, he reached out to me and asked if I'd be interested in any. Sure enough, we were able to make a deal, and I was able to help him out with some cash, and he sent some really cool tapes my way. So now I'm going to open the box up and show you what they are. First up is one I've been after on either VHS or DVD for a while now, it's Monster Man. This is a movie I used to see on DVD all the time, but for some reason, I never picked it up. And then, of course, it went out of print, and I could never find it again. I've actually heard really good things about this one. I heard it's genuinely funny in some scenes, and that it's just an all-around good slasher. So, I'm glad to add it to the collection. Finally. Next is The House on Tombstone Hill. This is another fun slasher film, and it was actually released on Blu-ray either earlier this year or late last year and it's also known as Dead Dudes in the House. I own it on DVD under that title. Here's yet another slasher film, Shallow Grave, not to be mistaken with the other Shallow Grave. I don't think I've ever actually seen this one, and if I have, it's been years. So I'm really excited to check this one out. Here's one of the most infamous shot on video horror treasures, Boarding House. Look at that cover, absolutely love it. This, of course, is a Paragon release. <laughs> Look at the image on the back, too. Yeah, definitely glad to have this one. Here's another classic, The Stuff. Amazing cover art. I actually already have this movie on VHS. I bought this one as sort of an upgrade. The copy I have was pretty beat up. You know, just the, the box itself was just really damaged. But um, I noticed when I received this, it's interesting. This is actually slightly different because the copy I already have has another image right here in place of... The, uh, the barcode, and I think the barcode is somewhere else on, on the box. So this is actually a, a different release. Um, you know, they're both from, from New World, but I don't know. I don't know which one came first, but either way, I'm glad to have this one now. Here's a movie that does not get enough attention. Evil Laugh. I'm super excited to own this one on VHS now. This may actually be the one I am most excited about out of the bunch, and there are some great titles in here. I just always love this movie. Um, it's It's cheesy. My buddy Andrew Ballin introduced me to this one uh, years ago, and I've loved it ever since. Um, you know, it's, it's another VHS tape that doesn't come up too often. Um, you know, not super expensive or anything like that, but it just doesn't really pop up all that much. Um, as for the DVD, that seems to go for some very high prices now, and I own that as well. So I'm glad to have it now on VHS and DVD. Here's a tape that seems to be in high demand as of late, Street Trash. For some reason, this one is highly sought out by horror fans, even though it's been released on DVD, in multiple editions, and on Blu-ray. I don't know what it is. I mean, it, it can't be a cover art thing, because even though this cover art is absolutely amazing, this same cover art was used on the DVD release. So, not sure why this tape is in such high demand, but I'm really glad I could get it from Movie John. Next up is the Anchor Bay VHS release of Sleepaway Camp. Now what's cool about this is I do already own this film on VHS, but it's the media release, and that one is actually signed by Felissa Rose. So getting this Anchor Bay release is just a bonus, and it's another movie that's definitely highly sought after. I love it, it's one of my all-time favorite slashers, and I'm excited to have another edition on VHS. And you can't have the original Sleepaway Camp these days without also getting the sequels. So here's Sleepaway Camp 2, classic artwork on there. And Sleepaway Camp 3, Teenage Wasteland. And finally, I am absolutely honored to own this tape right here, because this is the tape that Movie John considered to be 
the best in his collection, you know, his, his gem of a VHS tape. The rarest in his collection, you know, the, the tape that he was most proud of owning. And, you know, I felt bad. We talked about this one for, you know, about a week on and off. You know, he was talking about how he was interested in, in selling this because he needed the money and he knew, you know, he could fetch a, a little bit of cash for this one. And I sort of told him at first, you know, hang on to it. You know, I don't want you to regret it later. You know, even though you need the money, maybe there's there's another way. Um, you know, a couple of days went by and it seemed like he, he was going to hold on to it. And then ultimately he decided, you know, he'd rather have the cash and asked me if I wanted to make a deal for this in the, the Sleepaway Camp movies. So I agreed. Um, I got it for a good price. He definitely made some money off of it. And, you know, from there, we ended up making a deal on, on the other tapes. But uh, as I said, it's, it's truly an honor to own this one. It's a tape that everybody wants as a horror VHS collector. I own the sequel, which is even rarer. <laughs> and, you know, nobody has video violence part two. In fact, uh, Movie John and I would, would talk back and forth on, on Instagram. You know, he would say he needed that video violence part two. And I would tell him I needed this video violence. So now I'm proud to own both. Um, Thanks again, John. You know, I'm glad I could help you with, with some money, and I'm glad we can make a deal because I love these tapes. And again, I'm, I'm honored to, to own these. You know, they, they definitely came to a, a good home, to a good collection. I can assure you that. And uh, yeah, it's, it's pretty cool. I have a piece of the Movie John collection in my collection now. So there you have it, guys. Some amazing movies from Movie John. Once again, if you have not yet subscribed to Movie John, his link is in the description box below, and it will be on the end screen of this video. Please be sure to check out his channel, subscribe, show him some love. And while you're at it, tell him the horror man sent you. Thanks for watching, guys, and thank you, John. Be kind, subscribe.